Yo, what's up, fam? Welcome back to some more DayZ. My name is Raven from the Sky. Let's do this. Oh. You know, you can walk along the edge. Luckily, that wasn't too high enough. We didn't break our ankles or something. Luckily. I'll just roll. Actually, you know what? Check that out. Check that out. More food. I haven't even started planting my garden under that yet. Let me bring this out real quick. Lightweight. Oh, that, look at that. Eat that other plum. Kind of eating as I go. But I'm going to stop it there because, see, once we get really hungry, it's going to take like three, 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 four apples to really satiate us. But the thing is, this is survival. Kind of want an inch off of food because food is. Uh, Mm, it's pretty scary. I'm playing on an official server now, mind you. I'm not playing on like a community server where they tweak the loot and you get more food and stuff like that. I'm no. I'm playing on an official server. Nothing's tweaked. Nothing's tweaked. So um some food is scarce. That's the Daisy gods have smiled upon us here. And uh, blessed us with nourishing, sweet, succulent fruits of nature. Then you're gonna be uh, gonna be starving. But luckily, like I said, since that last update, um, it seems that you're, you're more than likely you're not playing like I'm playing. You're not a, you're, uh, your character's not vegan. You're doing not not doing a vegan playthrough. So. Uh, um, the chickens are more prevalent. It seems like there's a couple chickens in every town or on the way. So, I mean, and that's at least two chicken breasts right there. Take some branches, you know, take a rag, combine it. I mean, you know, make a fire. You've seen, you've seen how I play. You've seen the, seen the videos, hopefully. You go back and watch them if you hadn't. I've made fires. You know, but like I said, take some of these, make a fire. That long stick, and you break them into short sticks, combine them, make a fire. Uh, with a rag, cut off some bark. Cut off some bark here. Oh, my combat knife is ruined. I was like, why is it not popping up? We might as well drop that then. Cut off bark, combine it with a short stick to make a hand drill kit. Boom, you now have a fire. You can use that drill kit to light the fire. You're good to go. We're gonna turn here and we're gonna hit straight up and then we're gonna be at the airfield. The sun's going down, so we need to make it quick. Nightfall hits while I'm looting there. What I'll do, I'll do what I normally do. And um, I'll probably just hunker down in one of those bunkers somewhere. That's, that's a heck of a risk, but I don't like traveling at night. Dog on sure don't want to get caught traveling at night at that place. Trying to get out of there. Come on back here in the dark and try to get back to town. Get to the apartment. No. Need to hunker down wherever you at. I'd rather take the risk. This up here, where we're going, is the most dangerous place on the map. It's where everybody likes to go to get the best loot and to get suited and booted. Now, don't get me wrong. There are military bases all over the map. You just have to find them. But granted, not all of them are high tier, They're like mid tier, from my experience. Now, I could be wrong. I'm not, I, I do consider myself a Daisy vet, but I'm not some super duper ultra obsessed breaking the game down by code and patch notes and all that. I'd <laughs> I, no, that's not me. So I stand to be corrected, but. This is like high tier loot up here if you can, if you're lucky enough. Pretty much any gas zone. Oh, what was that? 
but I heard. I'm so busy running my mouth, I can't. Cause see the, the the sounds of nature they got programmed it makes see the random noises in this game. Like wood, a you know a creek, even though nobody's stepping on it, stuff like that. I much I much prefer the pickaxe. Cause it, the pickaxe to me is 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 better weapon like melee and um. Or better melee choice. Stronger than the bat. It's like the best blunt weapon. Yeah, so I guess it's debatable that in the sledgehammer, but I, I'm going with the pickaxe. But if I have a, like this with a player, I'm going to use the gun instead. This is really, really loud. So it's best to have a. There's no silence option for the shotgun, unfortunately. For the pistol, I don't know if they, if you can use a, uh, a silencer with the, the revolver. I don't think you can, but I don't know if you can. What about like a, the one, the makeshift one where? Uh, the duct tape and the water bottle. When can you put that on a revolver? I doubt it. Gun cleaning kit. Brand new too. Shoot, I'm gonna swap that one with the one I have. Has been used. We, we, man, let's, 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 let's head on in. Oh, this freaking really on. Now, when I head in, I usually head over to this side, head back to the back, and then work my way back up around, and I'll come back out here, and then head on back. Most of you know this, because this is my regular loot run since... Since I discovered it probably, what, two two seasons ago? Season and a half, two seasons ago? I used to just run up and down the coast. Oh, I'm, mm, and I meant to mention, I'm sorry. I have a playlist on my channel if you want to see the other, uh, if you want to see the other seasons. I know with YouTube, with the recommendation, it may not come up if you're scrolling, scrolling. So you would have to actually go into, uh, click on my, the channel. And look at the playlist and Daisy just going on Daisy. I have it all under one playlist. I don't have them. The season split up. It's all under one. So, you know, with autoplay on, you can just keep watching and keep watching. You don't have to. Oh, one playlist run out. Oh, I have to click off and go and go and find the other season. I mean, other playlist with the other season. No, it's just one one huge playlist. Same with APB. I look down. I keep forgetting to do that. Look down. I've been to so many places and without looking down because see play, what players would do, especially on PC, they will booby trap places like this. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We gotta go. That sound like it. We can't shoot. Chemical bomb. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna back out and see what's what got affected. I think these are the ones with the knife holster. Swap out for the boots. The hunter boots, I think, are the either that or the assault boots. I think it's the, oh, it's the assault boots. I don't see anything yet. It don't take long. Okay, we can go back. Because we would have been coughing, and we, you know. It, it guys, by now, it's back there, so I don't think we'll be going back there. This playthrough. All right, what do we got here? Tactical shirt. To match the green cargo pants. Don't mind if I do. Let me close this up. Um, 380. That, that's if we got the buys on, which I don't.
if I find a regular t-shirt, I'll probably swap out the tactical shirt because I want to do like a lightweight build. T-shirt with the cargo pants. I like that look. Oh, come on now. Police officer look for the longest. <laughs> oh man. All right. Now we're matching. Tactical shirt, pants. All right, we're good. That's why I hold. I hauled, hauled it because I did. I've been caught here before, and that, that Kim bomb hit. I'm like, oh, oh, I mean, landed right on top. I'm walking around with one solid color. <laughs> Swap it out. No. I'm carrying around no freaking luminescent anything. That's the, it's the, it, that makes you a target. You light up like a darn Christmas tree. That's going to attract all the players in the freaking area. Loot, loot, loot. Ladies and gentlemen, loot. Oh, my God, loot. Who is that? Kill him. Take his loot. Sure, you can see. <laughs> and other players can see, too. Keep on going. Oh, look at that. Zombie right there with a flight helmet on. It's badly damaged. I said I was going to start carrying these. Cause serious injuries at medium ranges. You know what? Eh. I don't like it, you know, badly damaged. I feel like if I get into a firefight and they hit me, it's going to go off. That's why I'm scared to carry them anyway, because that can happen. Oh, he's got the darn. I want that hat. But if I get into a fight with him, it's going to ruin. Let's go around here. Usually you wouldn't be able to come. Let's go around here. This place would be full of zombies. Uh oh. See, I got on boots. I don't have them trail shoes on, so I'm making more noise. And if he sees me and follows me, we'll just lock him in the garage. I'm not going to waste time. down. Bad thing about that is see they aggro the zombies that's in the area as well. I'm sitting here looking for a host. Last time I was looking for a holster, the chest holster. Dude had it on his hip, but when I took him out, he didn't drop it in. Of course. He aggroes the whole freaking base. I'm getting a wound infection and dying. <laughs> Just my luck, right? Obviously, I wanted this chest holster, but got one. Uh, I think I will. When I find a water bottle, I'll make a makeshift. Oh, that's right. I need to get some water. I don't have a water bottle. I haven't gotten any water. What's been sustaining me is eating these fruits. I got drunk water from my fountain earlier, but I haven't had any since. But that will keep you kind of sustained is, is eating the fruits because they have water content. 
So always remember that. So you can get to a fountain. Where, where did the chemical bomb land? It landed back. Okay, we're still good. I don't go that far back. At least not that on. Yeah, I don't go that far back, so we're good. Fire's on. That, that takes 380. I'll drop the shoddy for that bad boy if I find it. That's really good. Another holster if I want to carry another pistol. If. Ooh. Oh my heaven. Lord. Five, yeah, 545. Badly damaged. I have a cleaning kit, so I'm not worried about that. The damage. I much would rather have the Vega shotgun, though. That's actually a high tier weapon. That's what I was explaining earlier that. A player, like a, a spawn, a fresh spawn, new to the game, could stumble upon another de dead, fully geared player. Take his uh. Yeah, well, well, well I'll I'll pick up the uh. Stumble upon a fully geared player and uh. Take his Vega, come across you. And rip you to shreds. Got 545, don't it? Not 556. 545 by 39, yeah. And rip you to shreds out of sheer luck because he has a higher he has a higher tier weapon. Yep. Rip you to shreds. Be like, man, that's BS. Yep. Let's clean this up. I heard it. that was me making those footsteps. I kind of got, got a little paranoid there. You kind of develop trust. You just trust issues playing this. I'm telling you. Yeah, we're getting hungry again already. But that's the thing, the vegan lifestyle is meant for you to carry like abundance of fruit on you at all times. All right, we got four bullets. All right, we'll go for the AK. That's all it really takes, unless they're fully geared. Four rounds. Bop, 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 bop. Two out of eight Vega, Mag. If I find a freaking Vega. Let me take it, just in case I find a Vega. Then I'll swap the AK for the Vega. Because the Vega spawns here, too. If we are ever so lucky to find one, right? Come in here. Nope. Combat boots. Nah. I'll pass on those. I wonder for that stupid layer or whatever the heck that is on the bottom of them to make them two-tone colored. I take it. I don't really like that layer, but hey. Gotta find the assault boots. They have the knife holster, so. That's less things you'll be carrying in your slot. So usually I go all the way back here and then come back. What I'm thinking about doing is go ahead and explore this part, come back out, and then just head on back there. Thinking about just doing it. Because usually after I come back, I'll hit this and then keep on going. I have hunter boots. Is this, uh, what is this? Five 
I forty five by thirty nine. Let me I can add that to the I can add that to the what's in the magazine. up too. And you're more inclined to find ammo. You can find it here, but in that train car at that other military base. Been in Rehobic, I think it's called. It's way before you get here. That's another dangerous stop. I'm telling you, most military bases anyway are dangerous stops because it's where everyone goes to really loot. mini sites. So I can put that on the shotgun. I don't know if I can put that on the Vega. I don't know. I'll see. I can't remember if you can put that on the Vega or not. Tactical gloves. Actually, I like the wool ones better. Ooh, put these back. I usually go with those, but I like the wool ones. Best. So I think we're good. There's a heavy over there. What's a heavy? It's basically those zombies that are uh, that has on the plate carrier. You want a plate carrier, you kill those zombies, but it's 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 a task. They can take a lot of hits because they got on an armor and they got on a helmet. Nine by nineteen. Um. So we're good. I don't feel like dealing with that zombie. So what I'm going to do is head straight back. I don't go, go that far back that way. So we're good. It just it scared me because that was so loud. <clears throat> I thought it hit the town. But it didn't. We're going to go straight back here where the hangers are. out just in case sun setting so the sun nightfall is going to hit us while we're here like I said I'm just going to camp one of the hangers seven rounds Plan on taking on no darn army, but it'd be a, it should be enough to suffice. If we get into a little, get to a little scuffle of some sort, a little little, little pee pat 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 pat. All right, a little something something. If he's traveling with a group, we had to make a tactical retreat like I did before when he tried to run me over. I ran up that hill. That's a tactical retreat. Mm mm. No way, I'm not taking on three people. I don't care if I do have a shotgun. That's like that's the situation where you'll take out one and the other two will take out you, or they'll cut you down on the way over there. And they had a vehicle. And like I said, it looked like what which it was. What, you know what? It was. It was more than one. First I thought it was just one person. When I looked back, it was like two I think it looked like two, three people. I'm like, nah. You take down one, the other two will take you out. You take down two, the last one will take you down. And this is just complete utter trash and they're just complete noobs and don't know what they're doing which it didn't seem that way because he was trying to snipe me they had horrible aim <laughs> but um like i said that, that the high amount of stamina that i had is the reason really the reason i got away which is why i said i, I don't think i'm ever going to go back to the pack mule way of playing i don't knock it because look at the first I want to say the first the first season of the series, you know, I played like that. Really the first two, I think. I don't think I, if I remember correctly. I didn't go to light, switch to lightweight until like the third, last season. You know, may have been before that, but I remember a good chunk of this. I was playing like a pack mule. You know, I was carrying everything I could. Like I, I was carrying all this food, 
carrying all this ammo. I had two weapons, two and three, four freaking weapons, and like a, a tank. Tip that could hold up in there. I've done that before. So that's of a risk then, holding up in, in one of these. Not out in the open, but th those side doors we just saw. Ballistic helmet. Doesn't really. I would need a poxy putty though, wouldn't I, to to repair the the. the let me put this out to repair the helmet. Duct tape won't do it, I don't think. No duct tape fixes it. Nothing, there, nothing a little duct tape can't fix. Well, guess what? It won't let you fix it on here. <laughs> That's that saying. Duct tape fixes everything. Let me add this to the Vega. Let me see if I can find a Vega. I'm going to switch the KA for the Vega, for real. That thing, that Vega shreds. I mean, it can shred. Then I would take my chances of taking on a squad. It will shred a squad, especially up close. Because it's uh, boom, 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 boom. I mean, take all of them down. Now, granted, they're not going to be standing there. So you just got to, with this high, sp high stamina, high speed build, you just got to be like that. You know, boom, bam, boom, boom, boom. That thing was insane. That's the, that's like the, uh, that was the answer with the AA-12. Modern Warfare 2, man, that, that thing with a, with a drum. That's what it was, the answer to. AA-12. Rushing back there and not caring if he aggroes or not. Binoculars. Bomber jacket. Is the helmet's protected from freaking headshots. Let's go take this off. I don't want this. Take my chances. And that owl stopped like mid who? Why did he do that? See, when that stuff happens, it makes me wonder what the heck. All right, it's starting to get dark. Is there anybody in this thing right here? In this little barracks? See, KSU. I used to seventy four. Although I've heard the mini. Like a mini powerhouse. Cars don't spawn there, so I'm wondering who the owner of that car is. And if he's still here, will he come and investigate why that zombie's aggro? If he does that, I just gave away my position, but I don't hear any other footsteps. Which probably means he probably logged out. But if he opens his door, I got a surprise. Two shots to drop him, unless he's armored. One, really. I think we should be good to go. Yeah, he 
make some dinner. We're gonna call the night. It's dark. But I have never known any vehicles other than military vehicles to spawn back here, which means that's why I said I feel like somebody drove that back here. And the hood's up, so he might be off exploring. And he took the darn thing with him. Let's see if there's any. Oh my god, just come on in here. broke. Look at that. I need those seeds though. Thanks. this car. <laughs> you, you try, all I have and all you took is seeds? Yep. It's too much crap to be carrying. I don't want all that crap. Didn't have the Vega. Didn't have nothing I really wanted, so... It's getting dark. Let's uh, hunker down here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching. My name is Raven from the Sky. If you enjoyed the episode, drop a like and subscribe to the channel to see the series grow. Take care, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace.